Mr. Poroshenko, the U.S. announced that it will send an additional $800 million in further military aid to Ukraine, ammunition, howitzers, Humvees, armored personnel, carriers, even MI-17 helicopters. What more do you want to see from the United States and from its allies and partners? First of all, I'm very much appreciated for the great leadership which was demonstrated by President Biden, administration, Congress, and first of all, American people. Because what does it mean, this volume of the uh, military assistance? This is the game changer. Can you imagine that Ukraine need for the game changer just 100 jet fighter, just 200 helicopter, just 300 tank and 1,000 armed personnel carrier? And Ukrainian soldiers, with we have a long line of soldiers who want to be the volunteers in Ukrainian armed forces. We don't have any difficulties with the mobilization. If they have these weapons, we can create three, four brigade and attack Russia, throw him away, because this is not the assistance of Ukraine. This is the investment in your own security. And help us to do our own job. Help us to save the world. And this is exactly what we need now. And if you ask me what else you need, I think three things. Weapons, weapons, and weapons. More tank, more anti-aircraft, jet fighter, and radio electronic warfare. And Ukrainian just demonstrate, including the Neptune missiles case, including the anti-aircraft missiles, because more than 300 jet fighter and helicopter were down by Ukrainian pilot and Ukrainian operator. And more than 20,000 Russian troops were killed and stay here forever. This is how we Ukrainian and Ukrainian armed forces surprise the world with the underestimate Ukrainian armed forces and overestimate of Russian armed forces. And with the assistance of the America, this is a great idea. But another thing which the United States do is to demonstrate the leadership that other nations joined to, the, uh, to this process. And Canada, some European, some NATO member states also giving us anti-tank, anti-aircraft missiles and Soviet tanks, Soviet uh, armed personal carrier, which increased their uh, possibility. How I called it, this is exactly what we need, Land Lease Act. Exactly like it's happened in 1941. And I know that the Senate of U.S. has already voted. And my, uh, my request to the House, please do as soon as possible and give the power to the president to give us more weapons. Because, again, the weaker, the more, this is, would be the shortest way to the peace. More weapons we receive, shorter would be the way to the peace. Because Mr. if Ukraine receive weapon, it would be peace. If Russia... Do, uh, do not stop. It would be no Ukraine. 